to welcome you to Lunex Telecom annual gala celebration. Are you guys excited to be here? It's, it's, it sounds like this side is more excited than this side. Is that right? Are you excited to be here? All right, well we have a wonderful evening planned for you tonight. Uh, awesome food. Uh, giveaways, prizes, and a lots of lots of fun. Okay. Well, before we uh, we get started with uh, the agenda for tonight, there's a couple housekeeping items that we need to take care of. There. Did anyone not get their raffle ticket? Could you please raise your hand? If you did not get a raffle ticket, meaning no raffle ticket, raise your hand. <laughs> raise them high, please. Like I said, we got some wonderful prizes tonight. So you definitely want to get your raffle ticket so you can win. Thank you, Euphemia. Well, we're, we're all gathered here tonight to uh, celebrate another year, another successful year of Lunex Telecom, finishing up ninth year. So that's something to be very, very excited about. Uh, can we get a hand of applause for another successful year for this company? And tonight we've got a, a lot of treats in store. So uh, I am not going to talk long and, and, and bore you up here. I'm going to go ahead and just say welcome everyone. And let's make sure we have a great time. Now, we're going to go ahead and eat tonight, uh, and I'm going to ask these first three tables to go first.
lucky. Just wondering. Just wondering. Come on. I mean, I'm not going to give this thing away unless people are clapping for it. Hello? Hello? Greatest. Oopie is going to give you a little um, sneak peek of what's being offered. Yes. So we need a volunteer to pull the ticket. If you're in the volunteer. Okay, I need someone to volunteer. Please. Here. Here, just take it this one. Just one. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Oopimia. That was lovely. Thank you, Vanna. Thank you. Okay, I have a ticket here, okay? Go ticket. Okay, we got seven, seven, eight, six, three, eight. I'm here. Where are we at? Where are we at? Stand up if you want. Kelly, come on. Let me see that ticket. I'm going to bring you. All right, let me invite Eric back up here. Mr. Uh, director. He'll help to coordinate the rest of the evening. Is everyone enjoying the meal? Yeah. All right. Yeah, the food, food was great, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, I guess let's uh, let's let's give our our, our host uh, a hand as well. Everyone, uh, all the servers, all the people that are helping us enjoy this evening. I wanna I wanna first uh, take this moment or this opportunity and uh, thank the uh, the executive team. Uh, I want to thank um, the social committee as well for really putting this event together. None of this would be possible without you guys and all the work that you've done. Uh, this is an awesome evening, awesome occasion, and we're here celebrating a very, very special time in the history of the company. So I want to do a little something different uh, before I get into uh, my piece. I want to give away a raffle ticket. Can I do that, Euphemia? Am I allowed to do that? <laughs> All right, all right. Anybody want to win a raffle ticket? You see that we have awesome prizes. Mr. Kevin at IT, like he needed another tablet. I know. <laughs> all right. All right, so I want to give away this raffle ticket to someone who can tell us what we're celebrating tonight. No, 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 no. Not everybody at once. All right, all right, all right. Uh, let's see. Another reason. All right, Abraham. Good enough for me, man. Come on down, man. Give you this So that's right. We are here celebrating 10 years. And I think that's something that we all should be very proud of. Uh, I'm definitely very honored uh, to be a part of this organization, to be a part of this company. Uh, celebrating its 10th year, and our 10th year is going to be better than all the rest. Right? Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right. So I now have the, um, the pleasure and the, uh, the honor to introduce someone who is uh, very uh, familiar to all of us. Someone who is a, a pioneer and an innovator. Someone who I've learned a great deal from over these last, last year or so. And someone who I hope to learn a lot more from. He's someone that is not afraid to challenge us, 
So I want to present to most and introduce to some um, our fearless leader, Mr. Darren Liu. Come on in. Thank you, Eric, for very kind words. Wow, this is our event, and I'm nervous. How about that? <laughs> Must be the morning. <laughs> um, first, I'd like to say uh, thank you and welcome. Welcome our community uh, leaders. Welcome our community guests. Welcome friends and family of our, our staff. Um, it's such a beautiful, uh, beautiful moment. And that song, One uh, Moment in Time, is just uh, uh, so right. Um, you know, I was thinking uh, what to talk about. Um, ten years. Ten right? years. And, um, you know, it's, uh, it's funny. Uh, uh, there was a, a spouse of one of our staff uh, was looking at our um, display up there. You know, our marketing material uh, since 2004 and going year and year. I forgot who that was, uh, one gentleman. Yes. <laughs> and uh, he said, you know, you know this is wonderful. Uh, and you know, I'd be curious to know if you started out in a garage. It's a, an amazing, um, and I said to him, we, didn't, we don't have a garage in New York. <laughs> we actually started out um, on one desk in one bedroom in, uh, in uh, New York, uh, in Queens, New York. Okay. And uh, here we are with, uh, uh, such a beautiful crowd of people, and um, I uh, tonight there's so much to talk about. Ten years, and uh, um, I was having a long agenda. We're gonna talk about this, and every year what we what we did. How'd you guys like to hear that? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, it's it's uh, it may be really fun, but it may take a while. Okay, but uh, we we're, we're here to party, and uh, but uh, I can't just. Um, Party because we do want to uh, talk about. Yeah, you know, you'd be curious to know how we started. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and uh, and uh, where we are today as a company. Um, you know, we started with one concept, and the concept was, you know, in the phone card industry, there's such a it's such a mess out there. There are all kinds of games people play, and um, in the midst of the mess, we saw opportunities, and so back in 2004. We, uh, we launched one phone card uh, in the Vietnamese market. And we did a lot of things that was considered uh, unconventional. We, uh, we hired a celebrity, we advertised, and we provided customer service. And that was the so-called the unconventional things that we did in the phone card industry. Because I don't know any of you know, but phone card starts out, you know, and they sell for three months and they tend to disappear and they come out of three months and they disappear. Anybody ever use phone card? Right, you understand that. And, and so we, we, we decided to do something very different. We just had one phone card. And uh, I remember the, uh, the excitement from the people that uh, was in the founding team. And, uh, and uh, the industry was flooded with phone cards, but we're just gonna come out with one. And that was back in 2004. And uh, so, uh, long story short, there was a team of people. I used to joke around and say the company started out with three people, me, myself, and I. But uh, it's actually a, a team of people, and I really want to bring them up here tonight. And then, um, you know, and thank them uh, for, for being with us. guys, but it's 10 years so. <laughs> so. Well, first I'd like to uh, uh, invite Na. <laughs> I hope I cannot be that emotional. Yeah, yeah um, there are 10 years. What can you say? There will be a lot more 10 years. Right? We're going to grow bigger, and I'm grateful to see everyone here tonight. 
Thank you, everyone. So, uh, Mark is my, uh, my brother, my uh, co-founder. In his spare time, he helped us. Uh, he's the brain behind the uh, engineering of our system, of our company. And uh, he, uh, uh, all the business decisions that he helped me through the years. And I want him to stay put here because we want to recognize more people. And uh, this is tears of joy because, uh, sorry, I am uh, a bit emotional and excited tonight, but emotional. Bear with me. Uh, I want to also uh, recognize and thank the founding staff. These are the people who, uh, uh, other than Nock and myself, we had three others. Um, Han Tran, please come on up. He's, uh, he was uh, everything that you see in the marketing and the early years and whatever we have to do, that's what uh, uh, that came from uh, Tan. Um, helped us so much and just one phone card, we distributed this. And then we had Tao, uh, who was our customer service. Uh, work day and night, how to come on. I think back then we had one customer service for 84 hours per week. Um, um, I guess we're an emotional family. <laughs> uh, um, and also my beautiful wife, Eileen. She was working elsewhere and in her spare time. Helping us with all the, uh, all the bookkeeping at night, dealing with uh, all the, uh, the things that we were growing so fast around the country. We're looking at the, the founding uh, uh, staff of Lunex Telecom, and after 10 years, we're all still here. Um, and at this moment, I want to say everybody stay put and uh, help me recognize this team of people, uh, this uh, incredible group of people who really believed in our vision. And the vision was to produce uh, a phone card that's called Honest Minutes. At the time, a $10 phone card in the market was uh, um, announcing 50 minutes to Vietnam, and ours was delivering 35. We announced 35 and we delivered 35. We just believe that you provide a good service, you provide a card with uh, integrity, with the right product, the right services, uh, people will come. And these people uh, share that vision, and uh, they came with us and they ran with us, and uh, they are, we call it the Vietnamese uh, uh, marketing directors, uh, district managers, from all around the country, so please come on up, team. Uh, please come on up, the, the whole team up there. Yes, you guys. Um, it's. Uh, I just wanna. Uh, you don't have to give a speech. You just have to come up. I just wanna take a picture. <laughs> um, yes, and. Uh, Chuchum and Komar, you guys are included in this team. Please come on up. Um, and these are people, we had about 20. Uh, I think now we have around 10, right? Um, Alvin from uh, uh, Southern California, Fong from uh, Boston, Ngoc Jai from Hawaii. Uh, Ten, Ten is no longer a, a district manager with us, but we say we gotta have him here with us. From Virginia, and then from Houston. Cindy, the phone card queen from uh, San Francisco, and a uh, 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 queen from Minnesota, and a queen from Dallas. What a beautiful team of people. Uh, thank you. <laughs> and Tito and Kumoro from uh, uh, Jonesboro, Atlanta. <laughs> and I'll tell you uh, the history. Um, on the very first day when we launched our card, uh, we got so excited, and this is just a sample of the belief of uh, our phone card. Um, Tom in New York had to drive down halfway to Pennsylvania, and Tim in DC had to drive up halfway 
uh, in Philadelphia somewhere to meet up with Tom just to get the phone card so that we can get out of the market the next day. And that's what they did. And it's an incredible story that, you know, we were just fearless group of people and uh, just hit the market and religiously uh, go into a conference call for the last 10 years every Saturday for two hours um, to build the foundation of where Lunix Telecom is today. Thank you so much, team. That was 2004, okay? Now we're going to 2005. <laughs> take your time. Yeah, take my time, right? All right. Um, you know, 2005, we launched something called Pinless. And that was the strange, odd thing. That back then, nobody understood what's Pinless. But they said, you know what? If it's Lunex Telecom, uh, we're going to use it. Well, actually, three months into the industry, uh, it was a very tough time. We started doing 5 million minutes per month. I'm sorry, one million minute per month to Vietnam, okay? And uh, that just uh, raised the bar. People just said, you know what, you have less minutes, but you actually deliver. And uh, that was very important. And uh, that was what was important to Lunex uh, model. Um, and then we launched something called Pinless. And then we grew and grew to five million minutes by the end of the first year. And we grew and grew, and we then grew into the Philippines market. We then grew into the Hispanic market. And I'm gonna fast forward a little bit to about 2013. Is that okay? okay? <laughs> <laughs> um, but you, you, you have to understand, we started out from somewhere. Today, we have a staff of around 140 people, okay? You're seeing half of them here, half of them are in Vietnam, okay? And um, uh, you know, I was thinking of the incredible things that we've done for the last 10 years, or going into the 10th year. I know that statistically, 85% um, of businesses uh, don't last in the first five years. And then the remaining 15% that last, 85% uh, of that 15% doesn't last the next five years. Okay, and here we are going into our 10th year. All right, and uh, so we're very excited and very proud of that. And uh, uh, I want to recognize so many of the incredible people in our company today. And um, if I had the uh, some of the senior managers, uh, can please join me to recognize the teams. Uh, you don't want to hear me talking all night. Euphemia, Kevin, Quinn, Min, Eric. Um, you know, uh, please help me recognize and thank your team and. Please stand up, and uh, uh, we, we thought of the best way to talk about our 10th year and our best way is to recognize the incredible people we have in our company. So please give them a big round of applause. Hi, people. My name is Euphemia Erickson. I'm the Senior Director of Marketing, and I've been with Lunex for a year. And I'd like to say first what an incredible opportunity it's been to be exposed to some wonderful people from all over the world, and I think we represent, and our customers are from all over the world, and the people of Lunex are also from all over the world, and I think that's what makes this company so special. Um, so I'd like to recognize my team. Tom, of course, has been recognized, but I'd like him to stand up. Tom's been my right hand man. Last year, um, Tom has the heart and soul of this company always, and I think he's represented that to me. Um, and also the other people of marketing and uh, web development and QA, if they could also stand up and be recognized. Um, the web development team and QA have accomplished so much this year, so Tao and Gio and Natalia, and our marketing team in building websites and other things. So. I think they all deserve a great round of applause for what they've done this year. And also, our uh, so anyway, and there's Gio, who you'll see later from tonight. So thank you very much, and uh, they're a great group of people who represent Lunex to the world, 
and uh, sometimes their work is on display for everyone to see, so it's hard sometimes, but I think they do an incredible job. So thank you very much. Thank you to everybody, and then uh, thank you to Darren. I would like to take the opportunity tonight to say thank you to him, because I have been working with Lunes for around more than seven years, from the day we just a Vietnamese market only. So, but he worked really, really hard, and then we need to, you know, um, whenever we, we talk about him, we say the gray hair. What, how, how many the gray hair does the one do that? Make it to him. <laughs> and then, um, until now, today, and I have very a good team in the accounting, as uh, on the accounting receivable. We, um, the, the team worked really hard and then very delicate, um, reliable teamwork. Um, um, by tonight, and then I would like to um, say thank you to my team for the wonderful job that they deliver, that they uh, work for the company to bring up to now. Um, please help me to, um, um, yeah to uh, recognize and then um, thank to um, our team, Brazil. Can you stand up for us? Brazil has taken many of the town and collection. She's very good with the collection. And <laughs> Jeanette, yeah, Jeanette deal with us. But she um, very organized and then make the work done. She's having a beautiful one right now. Um, the the um, the next person I want to mention. Uh, this is the Laura. Laura, can you stand up? For us? Uh, Laura, take care of all the conditions on the distributor side. Thank you, Laura. Um, I would like to say thank you to Miss Pao. Yeah, how the one to handle them all the bank account. Any the issue related to the customer service or the banking, she the one to take care of everything. Yeah, thank you to Tao. And the next will be Miss Hang. Um, yeah, thank you to all the Vietnamese market until now have handle everything, work with the customer service and then the R team in Vietnam too. Thank you, Han. Um, the second Miss Ha, Hai Ji Ha. Yeah, we would like to say thank you to you. All the, you know, after the accounting hour, Miss Ha, and then we have another lady in California, Ha. She, she handle all the email, all the issue related to, you know, all, all the things related to the accounting. That's a Ha and Han. Do I miss any? No, we still have one version, Karen. Everybody know Karen. You know me, you know. Karen used to work in the garden as a manager for the garden. Now, as a guest. <laughs> Thank you to everybody. Hi, I'm Kevin from IT department. I've been with Lunet for uh, six years now, and um, I would like to um, thank you for my team, especially uh, Jerry, um, who the uh, ran for the whole system. Um, and also Chi Ting for um, database analysis. And then Alberto from wholesale, and then um, and he handled all the wholesale department. Um, and then uh, for IT support. Um, and also, um, um, I have a lot of people, a whole team in Vietnam. I would like to thank you, but they're not here, so. Okay. All right, so now we are going to recognize and thank the uh, sales team. And um, yeah, let's give them a hand. These guys work hard to make it happen. And, uh
to help the Lunex have another 20 years. How about that, Dan? All right. Yeah. So first I want to recognize, um, let's start with the California team, Alexander Paredes, who's the uh, leader of that team out west. And uh, Alex has done a great job in helping that team come together, and uh, we know that he's going to help them uh, take us to another level out on the West Coast. So we thank you for all your hard work, Alexander. Let's recognize the rest of the California team. Uh, Glenda Valladares, who's a sharpshooting salesperson, and she is doing a terrific job of bringing on a lot of new business for the company. And so we, uh, we really appreciate all that you do, Glenda. Um, let's also recognize Evelyn Reyes, for favor. Right. Evelyn is new to the California team, uh, but she brings a very, very uh, strong background that's going to help us really make an impact with a lot of our uh, key customers out west. So we thank you, Evelyn, and we're glad to have you aboard. All right? And Last but not least in the California team, someone who helped put it together as well and who has really, really made a big difference out there, and that's Leon Reynoso. Now, he's a, he's a Cali boy, so uh, he's, a, he's a back home in his element, and he's really making a, a huge impact out there. So we thank you, Leon, for your hard work. Uh, next, I want to thank, thank the uh, and recognize the Atlanta team. So these are all the sales folks that are based right here in Atlanta. And uh, first, I want to uh, recognize uh, Jose Carlucci. <laughs> and Carlucci is our he's our numbers guy. He's the one that helps us to uh, actually make sure we're uh, we're making some profit, right? <laughs> so we thank you, uh, Carlucci, for all your work and really pushing the initiatives of so many, so many of the groups within the sales organization. Uh, we couldn't do what we do month to month without you, so thank you for all your work there. I also want to recognize Juan Peña. Juan Peña has been a road warrior for us this year, uh, really just uh, putting in the miles, uh, just jumping on airplanes, getting in a car and just going out there to make it happen and really try to, to help Lunex uh, really hit the market and expand in a big way. So we thank you for all your work. He's also been an example for the other guys that are out in the field uh, making it happen from week to week and from month to month. Let me recognize some of those other people and that's Jose Vasquez. He's also new to our team, but we appreciate everything that he brings. I won't share his nickname, at least not yet. <laughs> but uh, yeah, you'll get, a, you'll get a kick out of it when you do it here. Uh, our inside sales person, uh, Abraham Villegas, why don't you stand up? <laughs> Abraham has a lot of great ideas. He's a go-getter, very aggressive approach. Love it, and uh, we're really excited about what you're going to bring to the table in 2014. So thank you, Abraham. And I hope he made it tonight. Um, do I, is, is Luis? He's here. He's here. Yeah. Where are you, Luis? Luis Palacios. Luis Palacios, come on down, man. Well, maybe, maybe we'll, he's here, I think, so yes. we'll go ahead and recognize him, but uh, I, I, uh, let's give him a hand, yeah, please. I do, I do want to say a few words about, about Luis uh, before, we, before I close, and that's, uh, he's getting here later tonight precisely because he was out there trying to make it happen. He was with a customer today that had a special event, a community event, a grassroots event, and uh, Lunex, thanks to Darren and, and the rest of the team, Darren uh, said, Lunex, we're going to support you, uh, our client, our customer, with staff, with promotion, with marketing. And part of that deal was having one of our own guys go out there and really make sure that the event was successful. And I think that's that type of approach that's really helping us uh, make a difference, helping us win business and also keep business, Darren. So I want to thank Luis for what he did today. 
uh, taking time out of his weekend to go and really represent Lunex well. And I'm glad he made it in time for the party. So wherever you're at, Luis, we, uh, we just want to thank you. Many more departments. Uh, Where's meant to help me recognize the, the customer service department? Okay. Yes. Um, there's one more person that we want to recognize, and uh, she is Joelma. Where's Joelma? Where is she? Okay. Yes. Joelma is new to our team. Uh, and she brings a, a lot of diversity. She's actually Brazilian, and she's going to really help us to make uh, huge inroads into that market. That's another new market that, that Lunex is going to uh, hit and penetrate, and to uh, really serve that that market well. And Joelma, you're going to you're going to make a huge difference in helping us do that. All right. Can I uh, have the everybody from the customer service department stand up? All right, we got a crowd up there, crowd up there, and then several actually back in the office working. Uh, thank you guys for working so hard representing us. Uh, Min is supposed to be, uh, well, um, we have many more groups, but I know that uh, for some of us here, some of us have to be back in the uh, office uh, taking care of our, our customers 24 seven. And so thank you for the, the hard work and thanks to the team that's actually sacrificed volunteer to stay back and take care of the out customers. Thank you guys. Um, there are many other departments. Uh, I have this another department I call uh, uh, Darren's Angels. Um, like uh, Charlie's Angels, I have this uh, Darren's Angels. The only issue with this Darren's Angels is that they keep on getting pregnant and then they have to keep on <laughs> taking maternity leave. Very disruptive. <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, Tanya, wonderful job, Tanya Flynn. Thank you. Uh, Ian, Ian Richard, please stand up. Thank you. Kate Pham, all right. She's pregnant, see, that's my point. <laughs> but, uh, oh, no more pregnancy there? Okay. okay. Well, this is our uh, Darren's Angels. Oh, and Tracy from um, our Lunix Express. Where's Tracy? Tracy in the back, taking care of the baby. <laughs> this is our team of people that negotiates and handles many different products that we develop and grow and develop and grow. So, uh, my hat's still very hard, very stressful sometimes working with me, but thank you guys. Great job. All right. This. Inventory Management Department. Wilson, Jorge, there's a whole team of people. Jorge. And thank you. I don't know if I missed out, left out anybody. Did we leave out anybody? I'm sorry. Uh, I think we recognized everyone. Yes, and... Uh, okay. Well, Josh is in the marketing department. Yeah. But there's another department. Uh, this is a, uh, we call it the social committee. Okay. And these are the people that made this event. They chose the food, the event, the health hour, the everything. They did a great job. Don't you guys think so? Yeah. Yes. So, Josh, come on, give him, give him for Josh, Tanya, Wilson, Wilson, and Joe with Charles. Thank you. And you know, uh, thanks to the team up here, the, the senior management, um, so much can be said, but uh, um, just want to say uh, thank you for all the wonderful work and working so closely with me to help build the company. I can go on and on about each department, how creative we are uh, with the, the marketing, how careful we are with multi-million dollars, but don't miss a, a dime on cut in terms of collection, right? All the creative uh, technology we have behind the scene and all the sales team, you see the people. Thank you so much. Thank you guys.
a long list of people. And there's another team of people I have to thank. Um, I sent them for last. Uh, this is the, uh, the VPs of uh, Lunex Telecom. These two people um, uh, are very, work very closely with me, making many critical decisions in the, for the company. Please help me recognize and thank Douglas Nguyen and Kit Liu. Let's <laughs> take care of all the legal and business development, uh, 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 strategic thinking with me, and Kit takes care of the whole operation. So these are two incredible people. Thank you so much, guys. <laughs> and, uh, well, about, about done. Now, I was told there's a video, a surprise. Uh, I haven't seen it, but this is a reflection of our team and how they feel about Lunex Telecom. And thank you, everyone, and happy holidays and enjoy. Thank you. Test one, two, one, two, three. It's the wow. Wow. We are wow. recording. Uh huh. That's fine. Cool. Shoot, it's recording, Josh. I will be a movie star. <laughs> Action. Hey, what does the word innovation mean to you? Something new. Um, it's like the tagline of the company. Change, update, make it better. Innovation means Lunix. What does POS stand for? The real thing? Or oh, POS? Public? Uh, I don't know right now. Point of sales. I don't know, I know something about internet. Uh, not really. Portal of sales. I'm nervous. Okay. Point of sale. The POS is the point of sales. I don't know. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> What's your favorite brand of coffee at Lunex? Mmm, Lunex coffee? Huh? Pick one word that best describes the lunchroom. The lunchroom? Empty. You need a word only? I only clean up the lunchroom. <laughs> Diverse. Wow. Boring. Boring. What's one word that rhymes with Lunex? Pass. <laughs> what do people say about rhymes with Lunex? Lunex? Uh. Sunex. Poonex. Linux. Linux? Oh. The operating system. Do you think the one click Max Man should wear pants? Yes, I do. Uh, it looks good naked. Ah, uh, not really. Yes? Yeah, and the hat, the hairstyle has to go. Maybe, yeah. No, I, I want to believe that he, he wears pants. I think it's a neat sunglass. Yes. If you could own a pancake shop, what would you name it? Uh, Café du Mans. Uh, uh, Laura's Pancake Shop. <laughs> Sticky Pancake House. Los Toros Pancake Shop. <sighs> Disgusting. Uh, Winnex. Lunex? <laughs> oh my gosh. Lula. Red velvet. I have two. Apples? Have you seen the missing apple from the refrigerator? Maybe. Yes. The what? No, no, I haven't, sorry. No, <laughs> no but I'm missing a few. Oh no. Actually, I saw Tanya got one in her desk. I don't know where it is. Actually, it's right here. <laughs> oh! Can you sing the Lunex anthem song? Oh, do we have, do we have one? 
Yeah. Lunax Telecom. <laughs> oh god. Uh oh Lunax you see. Oh god. Lunax Telecom. Tiền nào của nay, từng phút từng giây chung thật là đây. What? Lunax Telecom. Um, boom 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 Lunax Telecom Boom 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 Lunax Telecom Boom 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 Lunax Telecom Boom 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 Lunax Telecom Boom 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 Lunax Telecom Boom 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 Lunax Telecom Boom 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 How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Oh my god, what the question is that? <laughs> Can you repeat this, please? What's your favorite product by Lunex? Me. <laughs> I am Lunex. 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 Cut. Bye bye, everybody. All right, shoot. Do I look at the camera? We have better lighting. That's what I do for Lunex. Make it work. Come on. Oh, man. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start. Um, ready, Hank? No, ready. Okay, look. I'm ready, son. All right. Oh, my God. You don't know about this. Not even close. Okay. All right. Yes. Okay. But I'm too short. I don't know. <laughs> no. Oh, I don't know. Okay, okay. You're good. You Is that good enough? Yeah. What do you think about the graphic design? Oh, sorry. I'm <laughs> 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 All right, you're done. Ooh, I'm stumped. <laughs>